Hey, hey, welcome to the tea world, bringing you the hottest and the sweetest tea that will certainly burn your tongue. If you want to be called the tea squad, make sure to hit the subscribe button and a bell for notifications. Now let's sip today's tea. Hey, T-Squad, Mona Munyane has been through the most and from losing a child and losing a house that had a child issues through the fire. Mona tries to see the positive in everything that happens in her life. And with this one, she concluded that it was God saying it's time to move on and be happy. Speaking on Kaya FM, My Money and Me, Mona gave insight into how she spends her money and how through research she has learned that a lack of financial education was apparently holding back black people. My generation, especially is coming from the post-apartheid generations. A lot has been done to tear families apart, to traumatize and and disenfranchise them. We are sort of that generation who have to take the bottom and say, how do we normalize life for our children and their children? How can we help them go from previously disadvantaged black women and men to just human beings who are navigating this world and achieving great things in their chosen professions? She said, the actress also spoke about how being a mother has helped her to do a better job of handling her finances and ensuring she hustles hard. Well, another bonus for Mona is that having a partner who supports her 100% and T-Squad, have you seen those two, Mara? It's like they were made for each other from the way they dress to the way they pose for their pictures. She once posted this message on her Instagram and it reads like this. My love, we have seen life. You and I, Shem, you, the greatest part of this journey is the importance of sticking together, healing both individually and as a couple. I love you with every part of me and I am so grateful I am able to share my life with you as your wife and the mother of your children. What Mona shared about black people and finance, it's so true. We all need to learn on how to handle and budget our money. So T-Squad, how do you handle your finances? Do you save, invest, and which investment plan are you in or do you plan on studying? Do comments down below. I love you.